This land is your land, and this land is my land. You losers are both wrong. I'm telling you, he's giving me Yellowstone. Uh, wrong, and it's pronounced Jellystone. It's where Yogi lives. I'm getting that and Yosemite. You're getting Rocky Mountain and Glacier. Ugh, shut up, Tweedledee and Tweedledum. Jared and I are getting Yellowstone and Yosemite. We have great plans for developing them. Each park will have a Trump Hotel, a Melania Spa, and a Dick Cheney hunting lodge. That's so yesterday. My development plans call for Sitting Bull teepee condos, a John Muir golf course, and a Walden Pond Aquatic Center. Well, my plan has all that, plus protected spaces for endangered progressives. You guys are both idiots. The decision has already been made. Says you. The decision has already been made, okay? No, it hasn't. It, it goes to dicks first. Daddy defers to dicks. Kids, I have some bad news. We just sold all the national parks and their mineral rights to the Chinese government. Thanks to this deal, our national debt will be paid off in full. Huge. Aw, Dad, that's such a disappointment. Uh, yeah, after all the time and money we put into our development plans. But what if the Chinese build great walls around the parks and allow only Chinese tourists to enjoy them? No problem. As long as they build the walls with U.S.-grown timber and American-made steel and concrete and the dead Native Americans from the Keystone Pipeline. I'm still bummed. Cheer up. There's still the luxury apartments on Ellis Island, and the battleships were converting into cruise ship condos, and all of the bald eagles I'm having at Boston Gold and put on top of the White House. It's gonna be amazing. Have you convinced Congress to let us build a high-rise condominium over the White House? Not yet, but I'm optimistic. President Trump, I have Bernie Madoff on the line. What does he want? Have you forgotten? You pardon Madoff, and then you put him in charge of the Office of Government Ethics. Oh, right. Hey, Bernie. I am interested in a timeshare. There was a big high wall there that tried to stop me. The sign was painted, said private property. But on the back side, it didn't say nothing. This land was made for you and me.